everybody and today I'm back with mixed daily training what is up how was your first day how was the Monday everybody hi karma what is up hope you're doing well and let's go how was your oh gosh I have volume a little too loud that is unusual and I get an open immediately I'm playing Sir Master Stewart 1234 from Sweden Lady once I lost How are you doing? What's up, Pookie? How are you doing, guys? What's up? How was the beginning of the week? Some fine things. Nice. Currently, was able to watch the last Prague of yeah, that was intense. Yeah, Prague was winning, then then he went for a draw, but then it was close, like he felt like he wouldn't draw a minus person, but he managed to draw at the end, so it was fun. I'm doing Scarella, what's up? Okay, thanks to two. Hope you smash Magnus. Yeah. I mean, for me, it's like the perfect final. Because if Magnus wins, it's his first World Cup. It's nice, right? Uh, it's his first uh, win in the World Cup. If Prague wins, I can say I, I drew a, a World Cup winner. So for me, it's a perfect, absolutely perfect uh, matchup in the final. <laughs> if Magnus wins, I'm going to be happy for him because it's the first time he wins the World Cup ever. If Prague wins, I'm happy that they drew a World Cup winner. <laughs> so I'm, 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 I'm very, very extremely happy with this final. Very perfect, I think. Couldn't have been better for me, at least. Of course, there were some Fabi fans, I know. But for me, it's the best scenario. Scenario, scenario, I'm not sure. It's going to be interesting because like they are from the same uh, they're from the same club so like and they had the train trainings together so it's going to be really interesting to see what will happen in the final of course magnus is stronger but uh prague knocked out hikaru and karana and there you guys see and Lagrad and somebody else and did you knock out he first knocked out Lagrad then he knocked out I don't remember who he knocked out So he defeated Lagrad. Then somebody then he played Hikaru, right? Who did he beat before Hikaru? A6, Queen E2. 
UGT building before Hikaru, guys. Don't you remember? It feels like he was some Indian. So here. I'm not sure. Ah, no, Magnus beat Pansulaya. Magnus beat Pansulaya. Magnus, in the first round, Magnus beat Pansulaya with Ruki, it is thingy. It was nice. Aryan, yeah, but that's Magnus, that's Magnus. Yeah, it was Pansulaya, Aryan, then it was Skymer, right? Then it was somebody, then it was Abasov. Who did he beat before Abasov? Ah, uh, Ivanchuk and then Abasov, right? Yeah, but about Prague, I'm not sure. Who did he beat before Hikaru? Uh, let's play... Should I play Knight 2 or should I simply trade and try to play the end game? Hmm. Ah, Navara, right. Right, 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 yeah. So it was like Grad Navara, uh, Hikaru, somebody, Erigaisi, and then the... Ah, it wasn't Berkes, right? Then it was Erigaisi, then it was Fabian, now Magnus, I think. Maybe I missed something, someone, though. I wouldn't be surprised. Well, I think that's, that's, that's correct. Against Berke, she was a nice game from uh, Prague as well. The second game was very nice with the Shrook Sacks. Not Sacks, but Sack. Yeah, you can't remember Berke, Sergeant. Okay, nice. And he, uh, he can. Prague also joined the 2700 club, right? I think. If I'm not mistaken. Which I can be. It's a weird move, but I want to trade on my terms. That 93 Swiss Temple. No, but yeah, against Arjun, it was a thriller there. It was an absolutely crazy... Yeah, 27-23. Even if he loses both games to Magnus, he'll be like 27-15 or something, right? Which is unlikely that he'll lose both to Magnus. Uh, it's likely that Magnus will win overall, but I feel like it will head into tiebreaker. I don't know why. I have a feeling. It's the World Cup will end in the tiebreaker. A heartbreak in tiebreaker, uh, it was a heartbreaker for Salimova, right? She like was winning in the classical game yesterday. She was completely winning in first rapid game today, and then she lost the drone position. And I think right, if she would have, if Salimova would win, she would get the GM title immediately without any norms needed, right? But still, she played very well this tournament. Yeah. Why am I lagging today? Am I, th am I crazy or am I feeling like I'm like I'm actually lagging a little while moving? I don't know. Yeah, I might win. It's gonna be hard, but it's definitely possible. Should go queen of three. Very soon, yeah. Yeah, first he has to beat uh, Magnus, <laughs> and then we'll talk. Yeah, he gets e5. I'm not sure. If he was good to allow that, but he should be fine. Hey, Jundi, thank you. How are you doing? But definitely, this World Cup was very exciting. I think that's like the first World Cup I watch pretty much all the time. It's like before, okay, there was a World Cup, there was a World Cup. In one year, gosh, there is like a zillion. 
Anand Gukesh Prague almost right Prague is twenty second or something, but there's like a million Indians in top twenty already. Yeah, E5. Arjun also, right? He's some. Or maybe he's not in top 20, I don't remember that. But I mean, at least he was. Either, either he was in top 20 or he's like top 25 or something. We did. No, Nihal is like 26 80 ish, I think. I'm not sure. At least he was during this tournament. I'm not sure how much he upped it during the tournament. Uh, but before the tournament, he was like 26 80 ish, I think. Uh, let's give a check. Yeah, in one year though, yeah, in one year it is likely that Neil will be in top uh, 20. Very likely, actually. Let's go C595. Ninety five for bishop e5, what should I play? Hare Krishna? Mm. I think Hare Krishna is about 40s. 95, I mean, Bishop B5 is interesting. Mm. I'm not sure. For example, just simply Knight D7 feels like he should be fine. So I think Knight 2 E5. It's good. We'll see. Bishop F2, though. Not sure. But I have like queen e6. If I don't, if I'm scared of taking after, at least have something else. Where well, I should be safe, at least pretty safe. I don't know. Bishop b5 didn't feel too great. And if I haven't had a single loss this tournament, right? Even in tiebreaker. I think. I think Fabi crushed like everybody with a tie break, did he? didn't he? I think he's thinking about bishop. No, bishop. I mean, he was thinking about bishop, even though he interrupted me uh, with playing a move. Uh, yeah, I think he was thinking about bishop, but I didn't tell where, so I was correct, because he played bishop somewhere. <laughs> But I think so. I think I heard somewhere. No. The, the championship is underway already, isn't it? I'm gonna play it. It's already going somewhere in Czech Republic, I think, no? Thank you so much for the following, Justina. Fun. Uh, Claudia Maker, too. Mm, like, line 9 percent sure it's underway already. So, no, I won't. Even if it isn't, I won't. I tell check how you're doing. And F3, it feels like yes, we need two. And then like, I mean, I can take F6, takes Queen D5. Okay, nice. I think I'm actually just gonna go Knight F3. And Queen E2, Bishop F6. Just, just be safe, you know? I was thinking Queen F3, Bishop E5, Queen F5, G6, takes, takes. Oops, uh, takes knight d7, bishop d4. I wasn't sure how to evaluate it. Felt like he should hold there. And the idea if queen e4, I simply take a6. If queen e2, I trade, and then queen d5. This hangs, oops, and this hangs. Yeah, so he goes bishop c5. Okay, so he, he repeated. Queen a6, knight e4, bishop d4? No, queen a6, knight e4, queen e2 even. Or bishop d4 takes, takes. Uh, 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 uh. Takes queen e2, 
if knight f2 I take e7 f2 I'm winning if bishop f2 I thought knight d2 and then he goes somewhere and I take e4 I think I should be a piece up let's try that like we need to bishop default feels bad so like queen e5 knight f3 queen d5 my knight will be somewhat pinned but I'm thinking or maybe I should go for it. Queen e2. Okay, so queen. Queen e2. Queen e2. This knight e2. This is a threat. No matter where he goes, I take e4. And if something f2 hangs. Uh, so that's good. And knight f2. Oi. I take e7 and then king f2. I think that's fine. I goes queen b7, okay. What if queen c2? Here knight d2. I cannot move the knight and then I take e4, but then he moves the bishop. King f3, queen trade. And if it's a queen trade, he should be winning. He gets king h8. Okay, so queen e7. Oopsie. Oh, I missed that. Uh-oh. Bishop d4 takes takes. Bishop d4 takes takes. Knight somewhere f3. Maybe queen c6. It's risky, but I think it's safe. I'm not sure, though. Yeah, I missed f5 immediately. Queen is it's gonna be annoying. It's a queen d5, knight f3. Mm, but. Yeah, this if I get queen somewhere to e3. Um, so queen e2. If takes, I take. I will, I'll win f5. Otherwise, I think I'm a pawn. Yeah, he takes. Takes. Okay, let's go queen e4. Hi, Larian, what's up? And uh, somehow it's a dead draw, but I'm gonna try. Check. It cannot take. Goes here, let's go there. Check. King G2. Queen b7, this, queen f3, oh, he mouse slipped, <laughs> and then if he mouse slipped, steward 1, 2, 3, 4, it's from Sweden, <laughs> yeah, I think he mouse slipped, was I better, I mean, I, I think I was, no, no, well, okay, not there, ah, queen b3, okay, queen e2 loses the advantage, but at queen b3, queen move somewhere and I get a3 and takes. I'm not scared of that. I am in. What's up? I may go. Sorry. Okay, I was better here. Ah, knight g5, g6, queen c3. Yeah, and he shoots suck a pawn. And I'm better at this twice in a row. Uh, then it was very equal. Then here I should have played bishop d4 immediately, get the position like in the game. This is this, and I should have went queen b3, and then it was a drawing, and I didn't know why he played queen c most likely it was mostly Like, why why he hold the queen? Because I take this, yeah, I'm not sure. And then he played a queen. Okay. I'm doing good. Why, Heonan Gucci? How are you doing? What's up, why, Heonan Gucci? How are you doing? So yeah, I played this game pretty pretty okay. -ish. 93 accuracy could have been better. Yeah, if I found knight g5, queen c, queen e5 would have been much better, of course. But yeah, I mean, I, I, I haven't lost. I always had slight pressure and more time. That's it helped me. The time helped me in the end. All right, let me unpin this message. Boom, boom. Unpin. This game ended. So now you can. Suggest most guys. 
interesting looking puzzle. The house nice. can be the move. I even lost what's up. Yeah, that was great. That was brilliant. It felt like Fabi wasn't trying to draw though. It felt like Fabi was trying to outplay Prague. Uh, but then it didn't. Thanks for hanging on. So my ideas are either this or something like takes e4, but I think I'm going to go for that. It was takes e4. Oh, and then takes f2. Wow. Erica fate. And what? How does this have a 70% pass rate? Unusual. <laughs> crazy, a cr very crazy puzzle of 70% pass rate. Interment, take care, right here on. I mean, it's desperation, you know? I mean, resign. I mean, it's World Cup. If, I mean, he was trying, maybe Prague would blunder. I think it's fine. Why do you just try? What do you mean, why do you just try? Because I thought that's the best move. I'm not gonna sit here for 20 minutes for try to solve one puzzle. I don't care if it's an error. It's like puzzle writing is like the the most pretty much useless thing. One day just one day see you in World Cup, okay. <laughs> we'll see. I think I should play knight f4 first, including h6, then knight e6, and then takes g7, takes this, this, uh, and then something like rook c3. Okay, plus 5. It was rook c3 immediate, no? I mean, I thought for 3 minutes, will be that's enough. I thought that was the correct move, like, it's fine. Thanks for your concerns, but it's fine. G, I don't know. But okay, knight g7 felt very good. Queen d2 is his idea, right? Yeah. Uh, Rook d1? Knight g7, he got queen d2 immediately. That's nice. It's okay, knight g7, if he takes, I'm winning, but he has this queen d2 protecting that. That's nice. And then rook d1 with idea of knight g7. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, that, that that feels like should be a force made or something, somewhere. Mate? B4, king, B4, queen, C5, king, A4, queen. Ah, queen, 6, yes, knight, B5. Uh, And it has to be B4, that's for sure. Ah, it's far, far away from 4000. Just said 3900 quite recently. Uh huh. Check here. Ah, this he gets King string. No, yeah, I, I think I won't hit 4k this stream. But maybe soonish I can. 4k would be nice. Aha! Uh -huh. Check this, check this, this. Queen e5, I get this, this, this. Knight b5, check this, and then queen e4 mate. So b4 this, check here this. Uh, queen c6. If he goes king before, I get a5 mate with a pawn. If knight b5, 
I get queen e6 check is forced to go here, knight c6, king c6, queen e5. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Oh, goodness, no! Oh my gosh. Ah. Why? <laughs> Why? I mean, this sounds so bad. Famous last words. <laughs> KB8 now. It should be correct. This, 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 Rook A8, A1, G. Yeah, that should be somewhere or something. Do I bring my king over? King c3, king g4, king g4, king 5 he shoulders me. So push, push, takes. That was a nice puzzle. Exactly, thank you. Yeah, so I thought first rook h beat. Uh, the idea is if, say, he pushes, I just get king b1, that's game over. Uh, but the idea, the problem was this, is this, this, h7, and then g6, I can't stop the pawn. GG, thank you. And rook b8, I get this, 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 and king g3. I mean, I wasn't sure about king here, but yeah, I thought push, push, push this, and then rook a8, h7, a1, this, I mean, this has to be winning here. Queen g6, rook a6, I would win there. Nice, that was a good puzzle, I liked it. Queen d6, g3, h4, threatening in mate. Hey, lost. how are you doing? What is up? H4, if knight e2, I get queen d1, king g2, queen e2, that should be good. But the issue with this, this, this is king g2, I think. Uh, because if queen g3 gets some like king of one, it feels like. And I'm not so sure. I threw it at the patatas. What's up, everybody? How are you doing? Hope you're doing very well. Queen g6, g3, h4, king g2, take. This is queen h2, and that's winning. I thought h4, king g2, queen g3, king f1, knight e2, queen e1, queen h2. Ah, but then I guess he gets something like c7. I was just right. It was queen d5 and queen a2 and then knight e4. And yeah, that was a nice puzzle. Queen a2, knight g4 is unstoppable. If knight e2, I just simply. Yeah, that was a good puzzle. Oh, I, I think I remember this puzzle. It was very. Oh, wait. Rook hangs on f8, doesn't it? So this is for sure here. Queen g7, king c6, and queen e5. Yo, what? Ah, my rook kings. I thought queen c5, but they're my rook kings. <laughs> okay. It's like, wait, queen c5, queen c5, I'm winning, but then, ah, uh -uh, it should be one. Queen g7, queen e5, queen g7, queen g7, queen g7, king b8, queen e5, it should be c is good, but queen g7, I think he gets something like king b6, and then b3 gets queen d5, check, slight problem, if I'm relatively sure I have to check him, yes, and now, If I go bishop e6, queen d5, king e2, rook c, 
I guess Queen G2 and Queen C2. The bishop is Bishop 3, this, 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 and mate, or Queen of 2 and something. Now we game, yeah, yeah, that's true. G3 though. Queen D5. D5 immediately. So Queen E5. <sighs> yeah, it was difficult. I mean, I saw D5. Wait, did I actually just play D5? And completely miss Queen D5? I did. Miss Queen D5. Yeah, of course, just Queen D5. I'm good. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I, I, mean, I missed Queen, queen D5. Let's check. <laughs> I calculate Queen D3 and Bishop. I'm not going to miss Queen D5. That's funny. Takes, takes, takes. GF takes this, this. I have 5 on CS5 points and they have 2 pieces for a rook. Maybe. Take, take, take. Take, take. Oh, 94. This also looks interesting. 24, king h8, queen d7. And after queen d7. Oh, I hate these puzzles when there are like two moves which look pretty much both look perfect. Take, 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 take f8, take, 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 take f4. <laughs> yeah, that is a mystery why I on. I mean, yeah. My intuition feels like bishop f3 is better, but my brain suggests bishop f, f takes e is simply better. This, 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 this. This. Take, 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 this, take, this, oops. This, queen d7. Rook d8, queen c7 protecting the bishop, bishop g2, king g2, queen d4, bishop g3, rook f2. Yeah, yeah that was a nice puzzle. Yeah, I'm, I'm not mistaken, right? After takes this, 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 rook c8, yes, and this again, bishop g2, nice. No, I'm, I won't get 4k today, guys, chill. Uh, I, I hopefully will get it someday, but not today. 75 points is impossible in one day. I have to take c6, king e6, king c5, h4, king b6, h3. Because king d5 he gets h4, c6, h3, c7. No, he gets this, this, king d6, h4, c6, h3, c2. Yes, so I have to go c6, this, this, this. Nine. Oh, that's just forced, correct? Okay. Yeah, that was pretty forced. That was forced, correct? And that was pretty forced. I had this puzzle as well. I don't remember the solution though. I think we sacked, we sacked one of the queens, but I'm not sure. Didn't? Didn't we simply play queen e5, rook g3, queen c7, queen 7 rook e7, something like that? I'm not sure. Step by step. Yeah, true, 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 true. Ah, but he gets queen six. Yeah, I think it's queen five, queen seven for sure. I think. I mean, queen five has to be played now. Uh, yeah, it has to. It's a fact. Then uh, he ain't threatening anything ginormous though. 
What if I be greedy and just play queen e6, huh? Queen e5, yeah, yeah, I even lost it's queen e5. Nah, I mean, I feel like it's queen c7, but I'm just thinking, what if I'm greedy? I play queen e6 with the cf there. Does he have a force mate or anything like that? It's a question. That's not bad, many people struggle, it's fine. And I'm sure you could. I'm sure you could. Just trade pieces and that's all. Don't say bad things to yourself. Because like his threat is queen e6, right? So if I go queen e6, what's his threat? F4, F1, cross on. I uh, doesn't, I think he maybe gets this. Yeah, I think queen e8. They have to take. And now. Yeah, rook cg7, exactly, yeah, nice spot. Nice words, why high on? Very wise words. We'll say that. Rookie seven. Rookie seven, queen c6, I guess. Rook d8, queen h6. Oh no, he gets queen f7, but. I think it's rookie seven. Yeah, and then rook d8. Yeah, I had this puzzle. I was just making sure that everything works 100%. Yes, yeah, so this is this rook d8, queen. Queen h6, I simply escape, and it's important that queen keeps the g square for miss rook. Oh, I also had this puzzle. I think I had this puzzle when I was solving puzzles uh, to catch Hikaru's rating or something. Yeah, it's rook h8, g5, king g5, king f5. Yeah, it's this for sure. And yeah, he goes here. So I think I just go back in there, if not mistaken. I think I took he takes F. And then most likely after queen g7, king f5, rook f4, king f4, rook f1, queen d4 lost. I think it's king f6. And king e7 takes queen d6. Too many ads on Twitch, aye, aye, aye. Or do, should I be a brave king and take? No, but then he has queen, it's king seven. And now maybe king e6, because I remember it was some brave king. Yes, and takes. Nice! That was a good puzzle. 39 15. Let's go. Nice puzzle solving. Yeah, so this, because if I go here, I get queen g7, queen f6, he escapes. So this is this, this. King if takes, he simply moves the bishop somewhere, he's mating me. If king e5, he gets queen g7, he's mating me. If knight e5, he moves the bishop, he's fine. Uh, so this is this, and I escape, and queen g7, and get rook g8. Nice. Yeah, let me find that. Let me find that. No, not here. It wasn't here, but then it was 6-0 or something. I remember I posted it. This, I think. No, then it was this. I had this puzzle for sure. I don't know. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm hallucinating. Oh, sure, I did have this. I mean, I had this puzzle for sure. Maybe not in this article, so I don't know. But I had this puzzle. I remember the solution. Computer. 22, a random site. And I get back.
e4, let's go, let's actually go c5 against this guy. Against this robot, should I say, because I checked previous chips and I think I simply fight easily with black in the Sicilian. Yeah, we had this. I remember that. Five here. This queen be ah, he gets something. This. Hmm. This. Take, take. Take, 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 take. If take, then take, I'm good. If BC94. Uh, this hangs. Should be for C5. Ooh, maybe I miscalculated, but I think I'm fine. Take. And I thought if f5, I think it goes simply bishop to c8, king e7 should be okay as well. Uh, king e7. This. Take, take, knight e7, this. Now let's, let's go bishop g6. h6. Uh huh. This should be six rook d seven. Okay. Uh, bishop c five doesn't work because it's with check. Just a little time to watch. True. Let's do this. Takes rook d seven takes uh i think 98 is pretty relatively safe and then like f6 how are you doing lorgan what is up uh let's play f6 preventing g5 push uh c5 i'll give him this square get d4 square uh c5 if i get 97 king d6 even if it takes i should be okay so yes c5 this, this, 95, I think, takes, I'm fine. This, I thought, here. Oh, but b4, uh-oh. Takes. And b5, c5, king, c6. This. D7. Okay, of course, don't uh, cannot take, but I'm relatively sure that it is a fortress. If I just move back and forth. Ah, but he'll get G5. Maybe it isn't. Ah, uh, yeah, he'll get G5. Hmm. Feels like it should be something. Holdable. When for Rosen in the Blitz Sergeant. Ay ay ay. Okay, good luck. Good luck, Lorgan. Crush everybody. Yeah, it's not a draw, I think, actually. Mm -mm -mm. This. Boom. King of 2, a5. This, that, and I take. I'm good. And if knight c7. And takes king b7. Yeah, I think let's wait. Okay, he waits. Maybe it's a draw. Or he's given false hopes. 
in the two. Mmm! It was threefold. Look! One, two, uh, two. Uh, no, it wasn't a threefold. One, two. Okay, whatever. It wasn't. <laughs> Um, do you play Kindy so his knight is restricted to that it can go to? Yeah, I think so. So he can't go to c8. That's a threefold. Come on, ninety-five. <laughs> okay, here. Kindy three. Man, disappoints me. Kindy seven. So you're gonna go king f3, then, then if yes, then a5. No. Okay, this. Ah, now he closes. Now it's a draw. Let's go. He didn't even try king of 2 g5. Now it's just gonna be a boring uh, back and forth shuffling. Here. Yeah, that's that's how you draw 22 with black. That's how you do a handshake agreement. You just play Taimanov. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, this he cannot do anything. Soon maybe we'll actually get a threefold. Which is unlikely. I think he makes moves to avoid threefold. Yeah, king d8. I'm pretty sure we have this position thrice already, but... Okay, yeah, he goes here, but I continue waiting. Chess come rating, of course. If this grandmaster would be 26 feet rating, it would be hard. Back and forth. I'm pretty sure at some point he'll take c7 and more suffering. Yeah, I think he's also a little bit worried, at least, about my a5 idea. If he shut the side down, I'm pretty sure he is. Okay, about 30 moves has passed already, guys. Unless he takes c7, suffering will end soon. Oh yeah, he goes bishop h1, now back with the king, right? <laughs> yeah, why time on if is good? You literally trade all the pieces away, and then it's super, super simple to hold, you know? Oh, whoops, because yeah, they they're literally are like... Not, not too many pieces left, just minor pieces. Though I still think I maybe played this game a little too cocky that he got chances. But I'm pretty sure he didn't use them. Because when I played this, when he got this C4, B4 stuff, oh, it was a little bit worrying, to say the least. But okay. So it should be 8 moves left, everybody. It should be 8 moves left. Maybe I should move my knight away. Just so he won't trade knights, you know, and I'll just go back and forth with my king and maybe with a bishop. Just so no knight trade. It's your favorite chess game. From my practice or from like ever. And now I go 97 and then now it's a 50 move rule draw. Nice. That was a nice hold. The handshake agreement as we like to call it here. Mistakes, what the heck? <laughs> Wait, was it that terrible? Both. My game probably against Prague and against Shneshev. I should it on YouTube as well. Why? Yeah, he actually had G5. Yeah, all this time he had G5. Can't I just wait? Oh, and then he gets this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I should have played knight e8. 
Cause if G, well, I got lucky. <laughs> so much, so lucky. Though G5 F6, it still should be relatively holdable. <laughs> and then I finally play Knight E8, and then you never got G5. Because now if G5, I simply take and get my Knight on F6, I'm good. Makes sense. So I had to hold that with my Knight on there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I'm pretty sure here G5 as well, no? I take to take, I'm fine. But I was ill, I was worried, right? If King of 2 get A5, I'm good, yeah. Alright, so that was a funny game. 81 to 3 for him, 81 for me. Uh, what did I have here? I could have castled. Ah, and then Rook of 8 Queen is stuck, okay. All over the place, exactly, yeah. 81 to 3, 0 really moves switch was 0 great move for me, 1 for him. Yeah, 33 best move switch was 15 excellent for him, 10 for me, 15 good move for him, 13 for me, 9 book moves for him, 8 for me, uh, 7 X for him, 14 for me, 5 mistakes for him, 11 for me, 17 misses for him, 9 for me, 0 balance for each of us. But aside from these small blunders, small mistakes, inaccuracies, we played a super smooth game. Just like until about move 40, it was a dead, dead draw. Yeah, okay, what's the draw? Should have just played 98. I think. Or A5. Yeah, maybe A5. Yeah, you just gotta spam A5 here. No, you can't spam A5. Ay, ay, ay. But it's like so funny, like, some of it wasn't a mistake. And then, like, all out of a sudden, it is a mistake. A5? Nope. And I, now it was 98 all the time. No! Game review, stop, please start working. Okay, welcome back, Morgan. How did you do in the tournament? Uh, now it's not 98. I mean, this makes no sense. Ah, it is 98. So they start crying. Yeah, just 98, so he'll never ever get G5. This again, I do six and fine. And then, like for a million moves, we got the same position. Bishop c six was a mistake. So there is something with the move order, I guess. Terrible results. I am sorry to hear that. And now Bishop b seven was a mistake. It like literally makes zero sense. They just play 98 all the time. Or A5. Now 98. Then I had A5 with maybe... I mean, like, what? No, I don't know, I'm confused. Like, we had this position before. It was perfect zeros, right? Then we get this position, it's not zeros. I don't know, what was this? Just look. Here he had the bishop. I ah, had 0 0.2. Yeah, that was a very weird game to say the least. In the master, master, uh, Fidel Master was two, one, two, three, four, two, three nil for me and zero four nil for one for him. So yeah, we played the opening well. Then Queen E7 was a mistake for me. He should have played H6. I got knight g5. I missed that. The idea is we have bishop f6, queen h7 mate. Because g6, I get queen c3, this I win upon it would be better. You go for h6 again, and you go for knight g5 again. This is this, this, this. I was slightly better. Bishop c5 was a mistake. Yeah, he should have just played bishop a3. And then I should have taken, and it would be an easy draw. This, I had bishop d4. I was a little bit worried because of pin, but this knight f3 would be something similar like in the game, and it would be I would be better. F5 a mistake, he had bishop f2. This, this, 94, yeah, I calculate this line, but then apparently he just keeps this pin forever. You can just play anything like king g8 or king h8, and it's a draw. This is this, takes, and it's equal. He played a 5, I got better, and here I should have played queen b3, and then queen e4, queen e3. And then, like, play a3 I would be better, because in the game, I said queen e2, he took 2k2, and it was equal. It was equal for a long while, and I don't know why he played queen e6, and then just learned the queen, and was the infirm as 2 to 1, 2, 3, 4, is from Sweden. Yeah.
Yeah, that was weird, like, king h7, king g7. When I saw queen move, I was surprised, and when I see it on e6, I was like, what? Am I blind? But fortunately, I wasn't. But yeah, Taimanov against Komodo is my best weapon. Though sometimes when I'm in the mood, I, I just tried it out today. Because I checked streams a year ago, and literally all the time I played Taimanov, I, uh, I, I, I never lost a game with Black. Uh, because he's struggling to win in the end game, and resisting. I delete all variations. Okay, let's have it. Yeah, just like that. Wait, why are they moving that slowly? Why are they moving like they're in the replay? Am I lagging? I'm not sure. This, 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 bishop b2. Yeah, queen e7, a big mistake. Should have played h6 with equality. Rook d1, mistake for me. I had knight g5. The idea is boom, 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 boom. The idea if he goes h6, it's a huge blunder. Take, take, that's mate. So h6 ain't not the way to go. If he goes e5, I get rook a e1. h6, rook e5, I am much better. Uh, instead of e5, he also had g6, but then this is this is this, takes, 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 I'm better as well. And also he had rook fd, but then after takes, 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 king of 8, 94, I think, I'm also better because I'm upon him. e6 was a mistake back from him, he had go for h6. With equality, not a brilliancy, but it's a good move. Uh, keeping that. Then queen e2 was a mistake back for me. I again had knight g5, and I would be better. Now though, uh, now though, the best move is g6. Take, 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 take. And then uh, rook here, this, I am better. Because now already e5 is a big mistake. Because I get rook f1, and I have good rooks at these files, h6, I have more active rook, this, this, and I'm much better close to being winning, and rook fd8 would be yet another mistake, actually a blunder, because I take, take, uh, take, hold on, let me try to find out why, this, queen e7, 94, yeah, 94, queen e5, Take, 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 take. This, this, this. I have two, two extra passers, and I'm completely winning. Makes sense. Okay, rook d. Then it was equal. Hg3, h6, king g2, b5, queen f3. This, this, this. Okay, if I was sending a, a mistake, Stockfish says, you should have played knight d7. And after queen a8, this, 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 uh, knight before, this, 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 queen d5, king h2, queen c5, this, king h7, uh, queen e4, this, okay, that's this, 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 and I'm slightly better because of this good, uh, good passer in the end game. Still completely drawn, most likely, by perfect play, but, but I'm slightly better. This, c5 was a mistake should have taken. I was scared of e4, but then I got nice move c5. Yeah, I was thinking about c5 after e5, before queen a8, and here I haven't considered that, because if this, it's a huge blunder, I just get queen d3, oh uh, no, cd is a blunder, but I take f6, here, this, it was the pawn, but with the queen, this, is this, 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 bishop c5, bishop c3, I'm completely winning, get the king and the pawn to the square, so yeah, that's winning. And if win a6, this, this, he takes, that's yet another, that's a mistake because I take. Uh, he's forced to take this, this, this. He has ex very bad pawns. I have a good pawn, which is passer and I'm better. And if instead of bishop c5, he would go bishop c7, which stock recess is the best. I take, take. Uh, and then knight b4, this queen of 6 king g8, knight 6 and I'm better. Okay. Then bishop c5, knight e5. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I thought so as well during the game. 95% inaccuracy. I should have taken a6. 
And then Bishop D6. Thank you so much, James Gifter, for giving a T1 up to fun time together. Thank you, Animus Gifter. Really appreciate it. This would be slightly better. Yeah, because in the game, it's a very nice move. I wasn't sure if it works, but there was this. And the idea is if King of Two, that's actually a mistake. He gets Queen before. It's a hard move to find, though. It's not a check. This, this, and then Knight E4, King of 3, Knight E5. King F2, Knight H3, he's in slightly better. But yeah, after Bishop F2, I was planning Queen E6. And then Bishop C5, uh, Queen D3, we said draw. Okay, Bishop D6, Knight F3. That was a mistake from him. He had to go for Bishop A5. With take, take, we said draw. And this, this. This was a mistake back from me. You would have played Bishop D4, take 6. This, 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 knight e2, queen c, uh, not knight e5, but queen c5, queen e3, and I'm better. Yeah, queen, queen, e3, queen f3. Uh, queen f3, maybe even better, even better than I have this good passer. Uh, his pawn is a weakness and I'm better. Uh, yeah, so I should have played this. Oops, this, queen c2, f5, this f5 was a mistake, he should have taken, Ni very nice line, knight d2, then very good move, bishop b6, oh no, 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 not bishop f6, f5, and then after knight e4, then bishop b6, I messed up the move order, king f3, king h8, g4, takes, takes, queen d7, with a draw, alright, so f5, bishop d4, takes, takes, I got a better position, and queen e2 was a mistake, which threw the advantage away, should have played queen b3, and then after here, after this, I go a3, this, queen d3, knight f3, takes, takes, and I'm better. I have good chances to win. Hey, Psyn, there was up. And this is easy, it was completely equal. I tried doing something, I was a little bit up on time. But still, it was complete draw. And then, and then all out of a sudden, I attacked his pawn, and then I don't know why he played queen e6, which was a blunder. Just played king h7. Uh, king h7 or h5, maybe even better. We say draw. Maybe I think it was a mouse slip, and then he took his queen and one James Finamus is 2 to 1 to c4. So, yeah, it was a good game. I wasn't worse, but I didn't use the advantage at twice or thrice. But still, not a bad game overall. All right, now let's go to Evans Gambit. Last time we analyzed bishop e7. And uh, now let's check out, let's put engine on, let's see what is up. Most likely we'll analyze knight before. Knight before is actually even worse than bishop e7, I think. Yeah, knight before is another, yet another inaccuracy. We're gonna see bishop e7 is an interesting move. And knight before is an inaccuracy. So, if you're gonna play the Evans Gambit as black, do not play knight b4, please. Uh, we're just gonna look quickly on how to refute it. We play c3, uh, pushing the knight back, right? Let's see who is the top rated as white. Ah, this transposes to main Evans line. Uh, ah. Aha. That transposes into. Bishop b4, c3, bishop c5. Mm -hmm. What do we do, guys? I mean, I guess we have to de um, jump, in, jump into that. Because in the main line, Bishop c5 is a mistake. Ah, bishop c5 was played 1900 times, and now it's a mistake, okay. Then we don't mind. Yeah, so knight c3, main lines there are, if, 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 if bishop b4, c3 main lines are bishop a5, bishop e7, and even bishop d6, you know, even though bishop d6 looks ugly. Uh, yeah, so today let's do this knight c6. We punish it with yet another strike, d4. He has two moves, even three moves. One, uh, two are relatively bad, that is an inaccuracy. And one is okay, -ish, let's say. Uh, so, bishop d6. 
and that's looking ugly standing in front of your pawn uh, let's see I think we are simply going to castle we get knight f6, h6 and uh, queen f6 after queen oh gosh yeah these lines are quite crazy Rika play that against Stefanova. Was it a? It was one move later. So bishop d6 immediately. Okay, that's interesting idea. Mm, okay. So let's say we play knight bd2, right? Developing. Uh, even though it's stock which suggests knight ac, but I, I don't really understand this move. Uh, he continues knight here. This we castle. Uh, knight f1, h6, we get knight e3. Active, knight g6. If he does something like, I don't know, b6, right? Stock which suggests that, then that's a mistake because we get knight g4, queen g6, knight h4. Queen h7, bishop h6, we win the pawn back. And then we are better, so b6 isn't good, so knight g6 is the only move for him. Then there is a dubious pawn sack h4. h4. There is e takes d5, e takes d4, and knight h4. If knight h4, we take, take this, and then queen f6, we get rook e3, we get our rook. And then all our pieces will be here, so we are better. Knight e7 is a continuation, then we take. If queen g oops, if queen g7, we get rook h3, threatening here. This, take, 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 take. F4, idea is to take, and then after this, this, something like queen g4, king f2, rook h1, we are winning interesting line so knight h4 is a mistake we get we take knight f3 rook e3 and then knight g7 rook h3 and then take to take f4 great move crazy line he also has e takes d then we go knight d5 queen d8 c takes d knight h4 now he takes the pawn we play e5 bishop here then takes takes we sacked two pawns we sack a third pawn, but then we get queen c3 attacking the knight. So he's forced to go here, we get a 4 and then after, after f6, then we play queen g3, is the idea of f takes c, bishop h6. Then he goes here, now we take because we weaken, we weaken his pawn structure, and after a4 we are better. I understood zero, absolutely zero out of that line, but that's the best stockfish line, guys. After h4, okay, we checked h4, so we checked uh, this queen of 6 He also, instead of queen of yeah, so after queen of 6 we go rook g1. A lot of takes in this game. Yeah, it is uh, Evans Gambit. Yeah, a lot of takes indeed. Rookie one, Knight of one. We develop, then we sack a pawn, and then we sack yet another pawn, and then we win a yeah crazy line. All right. So instead of Queen of six, he also has Knight of six and H six. H six. Computer says we go Knight A three. After Knight of six, we go Knight B five, and then after castles. We take, take, we ruin the pawn structure, and then we go rook e1, e takes d, knight d4, and then once again takes, takes, yeah, crazy lines, exactly, and then we have two good bishops, he has very terrible pieces, so after rook e8 we go bishop f4, this we uh, take, takes, takes, d6, bishop f1, Bishop of five, c four, and we are better. Not only we have two bishops, we have also more advanced pawns, and he has a weak pawn on d six. We are much better here. So, what else does he have? 
if you use d5 immediately, pretty much the same thing, only we go bishop of one immediately, and then queen e1, we protect the pawn. And then rook e8, we go c4, oops, we go c4, rook e4, queen b2, and perhaps we get like rook d3, this, and we are better. Crazy. So yeah, we go knight a3, that makes, that explains the idea of knight a3, so that, and if he doesn't take, for example, oh gosh, this slow moving is annoying, and if he goes something like rook e8, then we get d5, great move, fixing, even though we are pawn down, we have good pawn structure, it's terrible pawn structure, knight a5, this b6, and then knight h4, knight f5, he takes knight f5, knight f4, I'm not sure what is more crazier, hd or this, 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 knight d6, and then if he moves, we get bishop a3, and we once again, we have very great pieces compared to his terrible passive pieces, and you know, we are pawn down, we are better because we get like some ideas like that, yes, that's rook e8, and ed we also call so knight f6 if he takes if he takes if he if he plays knight f6 immediately then there is a crazy move bishop d5 the idea for example if he takes that's a blunder uh we simply take take and then take and then it is a fork right here and we are winning so bishop d5 either he has knight d5 or Queen to e7 or bishop e7. Let's let's take all moves into calculation. If e takes d e4, we get knight f d2, knight a5, knight e4, castles knight d6. He takes back. We get uh, queen d3, b6, bishop a3. Oh no, what? Knight a3, right? Yeah, yeah, knight a3. This c4, and we. Once again, have great pawns, he has bad pawns, and then we get like bishop of 4, knight b5, ideas, or maybe c4 isn't good, actually. Aha! Look at that, we include bishop d2 first, and this we get c4, and then if rook c8 we simply take, and then uh, knight d2, rook e1, we are better. And if this, this c4, he goes for b5, we take, if he takes that, then we get rook c1, rook e8, h3, queen b6, knight c3, bishop c4, this, and then we are better, he takes, we sack a pawn, I, I am not sure what's going on, to be honest. I wish before isn't good. We get rook a c1 with the idea of like bishop e3, bishop d4. So these things, these pawns are bad. We have a good pawn. The size is better and we are better here. Uh, and if he doesn't take d5 and goes rook c8, then we go, we go rook c1. This, this. Queen c7, knight c3, rook c8. Bishop d2. Knight c4, this takes, takes. Bishop d, uh, queen c4, h3, h6. This, this, this. And if, for example, he takes, we get, that's a blunder, because we get 92 and a skewer, and we are winning. And if instead of bishop d5 he takes, we take h4, mm, something like this, f3. And we are slightly better, because again, these pawns are weak for him, and we have we are a pawn of their better. Okay, so that's it. <laughs> that's for knight d5. Uh, castles is a blunder. He also had queen e7. I think I'm not gonna go for e takes d main line, guys. I think after that, that's gonna be it for today. Let's go bishop e7. If bishop e7, we take forcing him to go knight g4, and then we can. Play bishop f4. This threat is h3, so he's pretty much forced to go here. This, this, we go. Uh, mm, we go knight d4, bishop d7, queen b3. And then now we are threatening both pawns. Castles, queen b7, knight d4, take. Rook b8, queen a7, bishop b5, rook d1, 
bishop h4, g3, queen f6, rook d2, it's a mistake, you know, it was the best move. We go e5, forcing the queen to go here, because he cannot take this. Uh, would be a big mistake because I think we take take on queen d4. I oh, know we get knight c3 and then queen e3, so like everything hangs for him. And, and we are winning. And if queen f5, we get f3 forcing him to take. Then we take take bishop e4, queen hangs this and bishop hangs. This is bishop f6. Then we go here with the threat of a4 and we are better. Okay, so after bishop e7 we take, bishop f4. After this he also gets g5. Then we go bishop e3. He takes, 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 takes. He sacks a bishop. And then he's dead lost. Alright, the best move for him instead of queen f6, simply going bishop g5. And take, take, then we take knight c3, we are two pawns up. Queen f6, f4, g5. Mm. Knight b5 takes queen d7, I guess. Yeah, queen d7, this is this. h5, f4, h4. Queen b5, we get our queen back, we are in exchange up, we are better. What is this? That is very, very easy to remember, guys. So, it will be a shame if you don't remember that. And if he goes queen e7 instead of bishop e7, we get a nice move c4 with the threat of c5. He is forced to take, and then we take, take e5, take, take, queen e5, rook e1, knight e4, f3, bishop f f3 he gets bishop g4 and bishop f5 will cover both of these if bishop f5 we can just take and then get like knight d2 one side castle knight f3 queen c5 queen a4 or queen d3 queen a4 rook h8 bishop a3 queen h5 e5 a6 Rook d1, we are better because uh, his pawns are doubled, this pawn can be weak and we have a knight. And if he goes bishop g4, we go... Are you kidding me? We go queen d2. No, but that is brilliant. I'm gonna say that is a brilliant move, guys, but I mean, come on, completely, completely crazy the queen d2 move. And... The point is if knight d2 we get rook e5 and bishop e6 this b6 we not let him play c5 himself we play c5 ourselves castle bishop e2 and we are better because this, the pawns are bad for him and if instead of queen d2 he goes f5 we get queen g5 and queen e6 now we take and then castle we go knight d2 h6 Queen h4, d3, bishop a3, we develop our bishop. Rook f8, takes, takes. Rook, Rook f1, queen a5, queen g4. Queen a3, knight e4, and we are better. That's it for today. I think we had, we, we've seen way too many lines, guys. Then we, we had to. I saved it, yeah, that was ridiculous. So today we checked knight b4, c3, knight c6, d4. We checked... Oh, we didn't even check bishop b6. We're just checking bishop d6. Yeah, I think it's fine. Castles. The idea, if he goes for h6, we get nice knight a3. And b5 takes. And then he gets bad pawns, and then we have two bishops. We are bad right here. More space and two bishops. E d5, we simply take. C for this, we are better. And if here he goes rook eight, we don't want to get the pawn, we fix the pawn structure, and we suck yet another pawn, and we go, we get it back, bishop h3, 
we have better development, we have crazy attack, we are better. Yeah, that is true. So, yeah, that's for h6. If queen f6, we go knight d2. This we trans transfer our knight g6, because if he doesn't do it, if he does something like, oh gosh, this slow moving is annoying. If he does something like b6, we get knight g4, knight h4, bishop h6, we are much better. If knight g6, we can gamble upon this e5. This is this, we sack three pawns, but then we get a piece. Queen g3, this, and we are better. We have the piece for four pawns, though. He has, he has an exposed king, so we are better. Then if he takes a pawn, we get knight f5, rook e3, knight g7, quick rook h3, takes 6, takes, crazy move for 4, knight g6, f5, queen g4, king of 2, rook h1, we are winning. So that is for queen f6. And, and knight f6, we get bishop d5. The idea is, for example, he castles. For example, if he does nothing and he castles, we get bishop c6 d, that's the idea. If queen e7, we get c4 with idea of c5. This we take, we lure his queen out, this f3. If bishop d4, we get brilliant queen d2. If knight d2, we simply take this, this c5, bishop b2, we have, he doesn't have compensation. If 5, we sack the queen once again with the threat of rook e4. Uh, so he's forced to go queen e6, then we take knight d2, queen h4. And then this is this, we are better after knight e4. I'm not sure why, but we are better. And that is for queen e7. If he goes bishop e7, we take bishop e4, we force him to do this, then we get a pawn. We get two pawns. If queen f6, this is f3, takes, takes this. We are better because we have a, his bishop is pinned and we, our threat is b4. If he takes, we simply take knight c3, we are winning. And if bishop g5, we take f4. And we get nice queen e7, and then we sack some pawns, but then we get our queen back, and we are we are winning, about almost winning. And if he takes knight d5, we take take, we get this, take take, this queen d3, bishop d2, c4. If he goes rook c8, we simply take knight d2, rook f1, we are better. He has a terrible pawn structure. And if he goes for b5, we take. If bishop d5, rook c1, this he again, once again has weak pawns. In rook c1, we are better, you know, we are pawn down. And if rook c8, we get rook c1, we trade bishops. This knight c3. And here, e4, we are a pawn up, and we are slightly better after f3, because we have a better pawn structure. That's it for today, guys. There was a lot, a lot of stuff. So I hope you enjoyed the stream. Don't forget to join the Discord to not miss some well stream and world stream, guys. That was a nice game in life opening. Great puzzle solving. We got to 39.50. Weird game against Komodo. It felt like we played perfectly, but we haven't, and we made a lot of blunders. Uh, though I thought I held extremely well. And then, yeah, everybody, that is it for today. Thanks a lot, everybody, for watching. Have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Take care, Pookie. Take care. Fun time together. Thanks, and use Gifter for gifting to your WhatsApp too. Fun time together, by the way. Bye, Pookie. Bye, Fun time together. Bye, Minus First. Bye, Login. Bye, Karma. Bye, Cinder. Bye, Bye, Hayon. Bye, Gucci. Bye, D4 Forever. Bye, I Mego Diego or I Men. Bye, Trita de Patates. Bye, Evan Laws. Bye, Jondi. Bye, Ioan Novis. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. Tubelerchik. by freeze chess at strokes three and everybody and scorelli take care everybody have a great day and i'll see you tomorrow take care everybody and bye bye